Hey everyone, this is going to be a quick video on how to sight in your Fast Eddy XL. First you want to do is just mount it onto the bow, pretty simple. The bracket and then two screws. This is the dovetail model so you can slide it in and out to uh, whichever length you'd like. Once you get that set up, you're going to want to figure out where your 20 yard pin would be. This is the double pin model. So the top pin is the main pin. Second pin is usually falls in between like the 35 40 yard mark. That way, you don't have to move the sight if a deer was at 20 and it jumps out to 30 or 40. You can still use the bottom pin. What you want to do is you're going to find your 20 yard pin. You want to run the sight on the lowest setting possible. That's what I have here. The nice thing about Spot Hog is that it does come with a stop, it's a little U bracket with a Two little allen screws just kind of screwed in there to hold it in place that way when you bottom it back out like that that's your 20 yard pin spot hog does include some calibration tapes uh, that's what it looks like right there you want to put the number 20 to where you are hitting at 20 yards so once you sight it in really good at 20 you're going to put the sticker on so it should look like this Now Spot Hog wants you to sight it in at 20 yards and then 60 yards using the top pin and the top indicator on the dial here. The range I'm shooting at today only goes up to 50 yards. So I did a little hack, I guess. Um, so what you wanna do, again, set it at 20, get that all good, step back to 30, and then fine tune it at 30. Once you get that set, you're gonna to wanna to mark there's going to be an empty space, I'll show you on here, on the calibration tape here. In between where the 20 and where the first red or black line starts, your 30 is going to fall somewhere in between there. So you're going to want to mark it with a pen. Um, that's what I did here. The little mark. So once you confirm your 20 and 30, you're gonna wanna unloosen this, bump it back down to 20, tighten it up, take off the calibration tape that's on the dial here, and lay it flat next to one of these calibration tapes. So your 20 is always gonna be on top, and then the little black mark that you had marked in the empty white space here, you're gonna wanna find where that 30 lines up. So let's just say number one is your sight tape and 30 lands right there. You're going to want to cut this off and line up the 20 to where the 20 yard on the sight is. Line it up, wrap it around the sight, and I guarantee you guys that from 20 all the way out to 80, 90, 100, you will hit your target it has worked I tried it last year and it works amazing so you don't really need a 60 yard range to sight in the fast Eddie XL with my simple trick here 20 and 30 find the right tape line up the 20 and 30 marks on here put it back on the dial and you're all set so I'm gonna take a few shots here at 20 and 30 just to show you guys that it does work. I'm not gonna peel off the tape yet just cause I'm still breaking in the bow. So maybe after a few hundred shots, I'll go back and get it paper tuned. And then I'll reuse this method again to get the correct sight tape. So the arrows that I'll be shooting today will be some uh, Black Eagle Zombie Slayers. These are awesome, awesome arrows. I'm shooting the 350s. Uh, 0 0.001 straightness, 100 grain field points, and the nocturnal light and knocks. I just want to say thanks to uh, Black Eagle Arrows. I did get the go ahead to be on their pro staff, so I'm really excited about that for this season. I'm really happy to be representing their company and their arrows. They have awesome customer service and awesome, awesome arrows. I'll leave a link down in the description to Black Eagle Arrows. 
that way you guys can check them out great arrows awesome customer service again i just want to say thanks to black eagle arrows for giving me this opportunity to work with them also if you guys haven't done so please hit that subscribe button down below and that notification bell that way when i upload new videos you guys are notified let's get you some shooting Let's go take a look at the 20 yard grouping here. Um, like I said, this is with the sight bottomed out using the top pin. And that's the grouping right there. So we're gonna step it back to 30 and I'm gonna use the mark that I marked with a pen just to see if it does work. It's my 30 yard grouping uh, using the little hash mark that I made on my sight tape. Hi. Hi. So there it is. This one is a little flyer that I had. But the other three are decent, I guess. Okay, you can take them out. The other? <laughs> this one's easy to take out. Look. Two hands. Put it on the ground. All right, pick them all up. Thank you. Yes. All right, that about wraps it up for today with the Fast Eddie XL. Awesome, awesome sight. Super, super robust and well built. Everything is, I'd say almost everything is metal. I'll also leave a link down in the description below to their website so you guys can check out their products as well. I'm not sponsored by Spot Hog. I just love using their products. Also, if you haven't done so, please hit that subscribe button down below and also that notification bell. That way when I upload new videos, you guys will be notified. Thanks for watching guys. See ya.